welcome to the 2022 edition of the men's elite race at the 5th Avenue Mile. Boom! Gun goes off and right away, Josh Kerr falls down as the race gets started. With the wet conditions, it looks like his feet just slipped from right under him. Jake Whiteman is the defending champion and is also the winner of the 2018 edition. Just a few days before, he was in the Zurich Finals competing in the men's 800 meters where he would take third in a time of 144.10. This race is underway and just like in the women's race, the field bunches up together. Josh Kerr was able to get up and work his way back up to the front of the field. Sam Parsons, who has competed in this race before and has done it in those performances, makes a quick surge right before the half mile mark to get there first and get the $1,000 bonus. In the men's race, they have to complete the race in 4 minutes or better to receive the bonus. Parsons slows the pace a bit to get back into the pack and this is where the race starts to pick up. In the front, there is Whiteman, Kerr, and Klecker leading the way as everyone else stays close behind. The third quarter mile was a bit too quick for some of the guys and this is where the field starts to string out. With just 400 meters to go, everyone is fighting to stay in contention and trying to outkick the guy next to him. Jake Whiteman is the 1500 meter champion for a reason and that is because of his endurance and speed. In Eugene for the 2022 World Championships, he was able to outkick one of the most dominant in the 1500 meter event, Jakob Egerbrixton. Whiteman is able to separate himself just slightly enough to keep the lead and go into the final stretch as the leader. Whiteman ends his season with a win and the $5,000 prize that goes with it. If you enjoyed the men's elite race at the 2022 Fifth Avenue Mile, make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel for more race highlights. Thank you for watching and until next time.